you know, for a legion of fans, there are a lot of memories associated with this logo. It's a hundred years, in fact. The blue maple leaf with the white lettering has become an instantly recognizable symbol. But after 45 years, the Maple Leafs are changing that logo, unveiling it for the very first time tonight on TSN. You are probably wondering what it looks like. Well, let's bring in CTV's Heather Wright for that, as well as all of the reaction from Leaf Nation down at the ACC, Heather. Hi, Colin. Yes, and there was, as you can imagine, plenty of reaction to this new logo. A lot of people we talked to, they like it. It's a sort of a throwback logo, very similar to the ones we saw in the 1960s. And some of the fans we spoke with said this is a good thing. Of course, the teams that played for Toronto in the 1960s, they won Stanley Cups. Others, though, say they were kind of disappointed. They say it's a bit lackluster. They were hoping something a bit more different than what was unveiled tonight. Either way, this is the new logo that will be on leaf jerseys leaf jerseys coming this fall it's the ninth logo in franchise history a throwback to the winning oh, so teams of the 1960s Kennedy, of i love that it's going back to the uh the history of the maple leaves so i really dig into logo Similar to the Leaf players wore on their jerseys from the late 1930s to the late 60s, the new design was unveiled tonight following Toronto's overtime win against the Boston Bruins. But team president Brendan Shanahan showed it to the team before tonight and explained some of the history behind the Maple Leaf. And even if the new logo looks a lot like the old one, change isn't always easy. Some fans aren't fans of the new design. A bit of a step backwards in my opinion. Um, like. Trying to go a little too traditional. I was expecting more like new font, but uh, you know what? They have to do something to make up for the team. That seemed okay. I mean, uh, I don't know if it's going to help the team, but you know, maybe they should spend some more time on the team and less on the logo. That would be helpful. Others, though, think the club did a good job taking a step back, hoping it's a good sign for the future. It's, it's all the glories from the yesteryears, and that's what the Leafs need. They need to bring that glory back from the yesteryears. I love the new details on the logo. It's very nice. For now, though, the team will stick with its current logo. The new one will be worn by players starting next season, part of the 100th anniversary of the Toronto Maple Leafs. So we might not see these jerseys on the players until the 2016-2017 season, but for the first time, we will be able to see them in June. That will be at the NHL entry draft when they will put that jersey on the newest Leaf to be drafted coming June. Reporting live, I'm Heather Wright. Colin, back to you. Thank you, Heather.